to identical equilateral glass prisms ABC and CDE are kept such that the angle between the faces AC and CE is theta. Area of light is incident at an angle I at the face AB and traverses through two prisms along the path PQ. Find the value of angle I and theta such that angle between the incident ray PQ and emergent ray TU is minimum. Equilateral glass prism system. So how to uh, how we can bring for two prisms this only for one prism okay no but the concept is brought for minimum deviation for two prisms. So from where to uh, analyze the idea now. We'll calculate the angle of incidence. How to calculate angle of incidence? Yes. We'll take this. R1. First, we will calculate this angle, and we know this is 60 degrees. At minimum deviation, because uh, the, the ray is parallel to the base of prism, QR is parallel to BC, ST is parallel to CD. So, therefore, we know R1 plus R2 is equal to 60 and at minimum deviation R1 equal to R2. So therefore R1 equal to R2 equal to 30 degrees from the field. Then sin I is equal to mu it is mu sin r1 mu is how much root 2 sin r1 sin of 30 degrees so sin i equal to 1 by root 2 so this angle is what 45 degrees huh? then this angle should also be 45 degrees equilateral prism is telling find the TU is minimum is telling so therefore this angle should also be 45 this triangle 45 means this should be 90 degrees. Because he has put a condition the deviation should be minimum, no? the angle between PQ and TU should be minimum, so therefore the theta has to be 90 degrees. Okay, so I how much? I theta 90 degrees. 